Mitch McConnell saying no blue state bailout. What's your reaction to this? I thought we were all in this together as American citizens. It seems they're taking partisanship to levels I never thought we would see. Yeah, it's, it, it, it is, you know, pretty outrageous. Um, in all the years I've been in Congress, in the House and the Senate, which is over 25, uh, I have never said, well, tornadoes didn't take place in New Jersey, so I'm not voting for that. Wildfires didn't take place in New Jersey, so I'm not voting for that. Hurricane Katrina didn't take place in New Jersey, so I'm not voting for that. I have always believed, I have always believed, that when one part of the nation uh, is suffering because of some type of disaster, then it's uh, a commitment by all the nations, uh, all those citizens of the nation, to respond. And that's the way I've always acted. Sure. Uh, but to hear Mitch McConnell and, and to, you know, uh, hear my colleague from Florida, well, you know, Florida sends less money to the federal treasury than we do and gets mm -hmm. a lot more. So I'm not I'm not really happy uh, about listening to that suggestion and Mitch McConnell to say that the uh, states should go into bankruptcy. The con first of all, the state under the law uh, can't go into bankruptcy. And secondly, what what a irresponsible uh, suggestion and what a mean spirited one. And to suggest that blue states shouldn't get any help. Well, you know, we didn't ask to lose uh, 6,500 of our residents. We didn't ask to have a virus that has infected over 116,000 of our people. And we didn't ask for the consequences that flow from that. So it is un-American, in my mind, uh, to make those comments. And I'm glad that we begin, that the pushback has begun to uh, create uh, some walk back uh, by Senator McConnell, uh, and uh, I can't wait to remind my colleague uh, about, uh, you know, how long this is. And, and, and I think that we're going to hear more and more from Republican governors across the nation as they face some of the challenges that we've already gone through.